We're coming to you live from Stairway to Heaven Arena in beautiful downtown Purgatory. And it's a long way to the top if you want to rock and roll. Hey, who just turned you into some generic classic rock DJ dipshit? That's the best you can come up with for the show? How about a nice simple here's the fucking kickoff? And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Baltimore Razors take on the Full Metal Mayhem. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones. Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking when I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. <laughs> his bowels he is loose and heading for the end zone he could go all the way first down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly in the open field bricks Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Briggs. This is going to get ugly fast. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed, it was a chick wearing a wig! And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hey. And the defense gives up five yards there. <laughs> Second down and five. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot. in for a first down to keep the drive alive. Well, that's a strange penalty call right there. I'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking, and it don't make much sense. It's making a lot of dollars. <laughs> They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Yeah, good game for I'm only Yeah, 
First down in a mile. Hot one, hot two. Hot. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First down and nine. Hot. Hot. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And now, look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. He's on the, now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. And that'll be second and... And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. And look at that ref run. He makes it out of bounds to survive another play. <laughs> Second down and more. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. One, hot two, hot three. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pink one passing. Third and two. Great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. No, I hope the kicker ate his bleedies this morning. And I don't want to see the comment section on that replay of the kick. Yeesh. That was terrible. Yeah, he's going to get the right fungal treatment after that miss. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And that'll be second down and four. 
Hot one, hot two, hot three. He picks up a two. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. at the Mutant Stug Farm weekends and summers. I think the are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! First down and one. Hot, hot one, hot two. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. First down and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a crazy turkey. That's so like he does have some turkey skin wrapped on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. Yeah, we got going to get him. We got to get him. Yeah, we got to get him. Yeah. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And they call it a enormous dirty trick. So oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Boy, he should be more careful when he hurdles. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot. game is starting to soften up the defense first down and it's first and ten and he was running like he had a load in his pants picks up maybe two uh, we always ran with a load in our pants Grim. it's a pretty good defensive tool yeah, except the zombies they are freaks for the first down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is 
feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Hey, guys, this isn't funny, I swear to you. Picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Third down and, well, good luck. <laughs> Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. If you don't hear it coming, it'll no. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Murphy Brown. What? I mean, first down. What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. This guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a time grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Huh? Huh? Second down and long. He picks 
picks up 10 yards on that play. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. Third and four. Oh. They run it for a yard. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and he's going to have to boot this one halfway to hell. Misses the kick, and his teammates are going to flog him when he gets back to the sideline. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. That's a T-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? Third quarter, we are all tied up and set to kick off the second half. Uh, speaking of all tied up, Grim, how many of them elephant lags in a belt did I take? Uh, I feel like I'm sitting on Mount Vesuvio right now. Oh, one false move, and I'm gonna blow! Come on, Cello! I am a hell of a fellow! The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And that's how you stop an offense. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Third down and eight. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And that is first down. Quarterbacks tight spirals and magnetic and that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service located just off the Beltway exit 5. Got yeah, get the hell out of here, man. And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps on kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. 
First down and forever. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. First and ten. run before he stopped. Third down and the punter is warming up. Oh, and he just turns to enormous. Look out. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback. And they went to the air and came up big. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. And they stack the line and he gets this for a yard. Third down and eight. First and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I mean, and anything really tastes good. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. Yeah, that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and nine. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, on to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's 
first and ten. He's got his beast boot working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. <laughs> second down and more than the QB would like. when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Uh, is the game over yet? I gotta go to the vet to have him reattach my big coat of where my tongue was again. It just fell off for the third time today. I was barely even chewing on it. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third and two. Oh. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. The punter for today is being played by my kid's sister. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three.
Third down and five. First and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards. Second down and five. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Second down and nine. The 10. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. First down and three. And he lateral. And he just gave a gift to the defense with that boneheaded lateral. was an all-pro NFL hit. And this rip is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. First and two. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First down and one. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I uh, tap off my drink. When they do that. <laughs> And the defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. Third down and three. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They're feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. They've used a strawberry field dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't know which way forward is now. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of from here on out. Fix 
picks up two yards on the pass. And this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and got... And they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Glenn. Well, and the defense, too. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. <laughs> Too little, too late for the offense. This is their last gasp. Fucking choke, guys. And the team refuses to quit. They stay alive with four new downs. And it's first and ten. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. One's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. He might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. I, I, one, I, and he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go! He's unstoppable! And he bursts into the end zone for the score! What a run! <laughs> hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he plows forward for the two-point conversion! Throw up the horns and throw up the W. Full Metal Mayhem win. It was a brutal battle of attrition, but they come away with a three-point win and are celebrating on the field. Yeah, and giving the ref a few bucks didn't hurt the cause either. Well, it hurt my cause. I had a saw buck on this fucking game. The game's most valuable player is about to... Final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation.